I ordered two wedding cakes. Nope, still not getting married. But yes, still love cake. And any excuse is a good excuse to eat not one, but two cakes. I ordered one from a one-star bakery and another one from a five-star bakery. What cake shall be the tastiest of them all? Place your bet, the battle is about to begin. Hi guys, I'm Mar. And today I am all ready. I'm all dressed up. I'm literally about to match my cakes because it's a great day. I get to eat two whole cakes. But before we could sit down, for this glorious moment, I had serious matters to tend to. I had cakes to pick, and the bride has options, honey. If you're looking for wedding cakes, there's just so many. I went on Pinterest, and I was a very confused bride because there was just too many cakes going around, so I needed to narrow it down. I decided this time around, I wanted a colorful wedding cake because, hey, I could probably pass that off as a regular cake and pay less money because when you put the word wedding in front of anything, that immediately just drives the price up. So first, we have this beautiful cake with bright colors. Just a flower here and there. It's very glamorous and very tropical at the same time. Oh, and are those some churros I see on the side? Oh, this cake winning. We also have this beautiful garden cake. Like you just left it outside and some random weeds started growing on it. This cake that your grandmother would 100% approve of. This refreshing grapefruit cake. I just look at it and I immediately feel fresh. This cake that low-key looks like a kindergarten project, but one that went right. You got yourself a real artsy kit, ma'am. And this beautiful galaxy cake. It just has a little ball and I love balls. It's purple and I love purple and it got a little bit of a drip and honey I love a good drip. So our panel of judges decided and me myself and I decided to go for drum roll please the cake with balls on it. Yep that's what I'm gonna call it. So first we're gonna start with the one star review cake and you are not ready for this. Are you ready? Okay here she is is oh my god she's everything i've been dreaming of so let me tell you i got this cake from the same one star bakery i went to on my last video where i tried different cakes and i'm sorry but i just had to this cake was also 15 dollars which says a lot about them this time around i didn't say it was a wedding cake i just said it's a cake ma'am and you know what you might be out here saying well mar that doesn't really look like a wedding cake and don't let nobody judge you if you want this to be your wedding cake then this is your wedding cake girl but it was still 15 dollars which I thought was great. That means they didn't upcharge on my other cake. I mean, I think it's kind of difficult to upcharge on $15. And let's look at her. I feel like they did a really good job with the color. It even has the little stars. The material, I think it might be cream. So it for sure has cream on top, just like the cake I sent them. But the sides, so far, I haven't stuck my finger in there, but I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna see what it's made of. Oh, it's cream for sure. Mm, that's tasty. I get... <laughs> still blue whatever coloring they're using it's strong i honestly cannot believe this cake is 15 dollars. it's so beautiful the drip is the only part where i'm like mm. it doesn't look as well done i guess it doesn't look as straight but this 15 dollars, you're doing amazing sweetie i did realize she's kind of falling a little bit to the side but that's all right girl you're 15 now for the taste if you watched my other video, you know, we had issues with the taste So I asked for a different flavor I gave both the one star and the five star bakery both the same exact instructions And that's for the cake to be vanilla with chocolate mousse. That's what I would have about wedding real sophisticated now So let me try these stars. I wonder if these are edible. These are so cute Mmm. Oh, they taste you. They also have the little balls, but they're actually pretty small balls. They're not big balls, but they're beautiful. I love that they were able to do this kind of shower star looking thing. And she came all dressed up too. This cake really got me feeling bad because $15, I'm like, ma'am, you're overworking yourself. $15 for this whole cake. I mean, this must have taken hours just to place the little stars and the little balls. But now for the five star cake. <laughs> I'm sorry, ma'am. Out with the old. So let me just give you guys a little bit of backstory. I did another video like this, and for my five-star cake, I paid $260. And honestly, I was feeling like that was a bit up there. You know, a bit on the expensive side. But a lot of you said that $260 was perfectly okay for a cake of that size and that look. And I mean, I don't want to insult no one, but now that I got this cake, I'm not so sure, girl. So let me just tell you all about this five-star cake. So I did everything by phone. I just ordered the picture 
like trivia email. It's a really cute local bakery. It's a really small place and they have amazing reviews. Danielle says that he made her wedding cakes multiple. Danielle got a budget, honey, and she could not have been happier. They did a fantastic job. The cake itself was delicious and her guests raved about it. Another person says that this is one of their favorite places. This place is amazing. They drive out just to come and get their cakes. So they got good cake. Now, I did not say that this was a wedding cake. So I don't know if this affected what happened, but let me just show you guys. Behold, the five star cake. Here she is. All right, this cake is absolutely beautiful and it looks exactly like the picture I said. Exactly. Everything is perfect. I feel like they did such an amazing job. It has the little stars. It has a little sprinkling. The material, it has cream on top, but this is definitely fondant because I could just touch it and it's not melting or anything. Oh, it's not as pigmented. I'm low-key a little bit scared. Why was the other one so pigmented? This is not eyeshadow. Don't worry. Now, I need you guys to go right now, drop a comment, and tell me how much you think this cake was. Go, I see you, go. Y'all better be sitting down. This cake was $40. Four, zero, 40. What, sir? This whole cake? I feel like I gotta go and do an internship at this bakery. I gotta help them out washing some of those dishes. This beautiful cake for $40 is really making me reconsider my one star bakery. Cause I'm like, girl, you're great. Cause you're only $15. But then you can also get this for $40. Wow. This cake has all the little balls, the little stars, and it has them on the top as well. So you can see how it's like full of cream and little things. This one's actually empty, which is fine because in the picture you couldn't really see. So it's okay. I mean, they could take creative liberties with this. Let me just eat one of these little balls. Let's see. Okay, you can eat them. I'm like, mm, they're sweet. Mmm, they're chocolate. Oh wow, that's delicious. Mm, mm, mm. And the stars, oh, come back star, come back. Mmm, this is so tasty. Those balls are delicious. Honestly, I feel like it's unfair to compare these two because I feel like both of these cakes are just absurdly underpriced and I feel like I should have paid more. But I did tip, girl. But now it's the moment of truth time for the taste test. So first I'm gonna cut into my one star cake and don't judge me for the way I cut into my cake. Just let me live my life. I'm not judging you for watching cake videos on the toilet. So, all right, here we go. This cake is so soft. It smells good. It smells really sugary, but I kinda don't trust this cake. I'm like, mm, your sister already betrayed me. All right, we're cutting in the slice. It's really, really soft. Oh no, not again. Wait, stop. What is that? It has some white liquid on it, but why? There's nothing green, only white, so that's much better. It looks like it's vanilla and then it has the chocolate, but between the layers of chocolate, I guess it has some sort of cream or something. I don't know if that's just to make it stick maybe. So let me give it a try. This cake feels like it has some sort of liquid on it. I don't know if you can just see it. It's so hard to describe it. It's almost like wet. Hmm. Oh god. You guys, this is gonna sound very strange, but that tastes like mint. Why mint? It is sweet, but it has a minty aftertaste. Why would vanilla with chocolate mousse have a minty aftertaste? It's just not good. Mm, mm, mm. I really wanted to give this place another go because I thought maybe they had gotten confused and they put salt instead of sugar on my last cake. But I think there's some problems going on in that kitchen. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, now I'm gonna cleanse my palate. Hopefully with a five star. Oh, you let me down just like your sister. Literally my mom. Hopefully this girl does better. Do better cake. So I'm just gonna cut into this. This cake is much, much taller. Oh, it also feels really, really soft. Honestly, it's softer than I thought it was gonna be. Ooh, there we go. And now I'm gonna get my slice out. Help, some of y'all professional cake slicers come help me. Oh no, why is the whole thing lifting? Cake? Oh, I think it has a base. Oh, it has like a cardboard base. Okay, okay, I'm just pulling this out. Ooh, this is different. So this actually looks like chocolate mousse because I asked for chocolate mousse and I think the one star place just put some random chocolate in there there's no white stuff on this cake it's just vanilla and I love that it has quite a bit of chocolate this actually looks delicious please Jesus let it be good it's good but I will say the cake from the other video the one that was super expensive was actually better this one's good though. It tastes literally like vanilla and chocolate mousse. It feels very like homey. The chocolate feels really rich. Like it tastes so good, but it's like milk chocolate. It's good cake. And for $40, yes. 
So I hate to be the one to bring the bad news. I hate to be the one to have to pick a cake. And usually with food, I just have no favorites. Just give it all to me. But this time I will say this cake to me is the clear winner. I mean, it has a great price. It tastes so good. It looks exactly like the picture. She's just a beauty. She has looks, she has inner beauty, and she affordable. I mean, really, we can't ask for more. But yeah, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to check out the other video I did with cakes like this. And yeah, I'll see you on the next one.